This is certainly one of the most advanced cocktail tricks that I know of, but the presentation is just so unique and the smoke leaves a wonderful aroma on top of the drink. So if you're up for the challenge, I'll take you through the steps of how to make this cocktail. So here's the equipment you're gonna need. From left to right, you're gonna need some aluminum foil, some wood chips, a toothpick, a small hammer, some tongs, and a funnel. You can find links to this equipment at cocktailchemistrylab.com. You're also gonna need a hollowed out ice shell. I actually have a whole video dedicated to making these. Okay, once you have your equipment together, start by taking that aluminum foil and folding it into a little base like this. So for the smoke, I'm gonna be using wood chips made out of hickory, but you can also use other woods like apple wood. Then take your toothpick and skewer one maraschino cherry. This is gonna be important for plugging up the hole after you fill that ball with smoke. Now you're gonna to wanna to practice the technique first. So once you light that wood on fire, place it on the foil, then take your funnel and cover up the wood. That will extinguish it and have the smoke come up. Then you're gonna fill the ice ball and then plug it with the toothpick and cherry. You're also then gonna to wanna to have your cocktail prepared. So here we're gonna make something called a black Manhattan. This is a twist on the original Manhattan using Averna instead of sweet vermouth. You can find this recipe and the measurements at cocktailchemistrylab.com. So just give that a stir and set it aside. Now to light the wood on fire, I find it's easiest just to use the tongs and hold it over the burner. Once that's well lit, carefully bring it back to the tin foil and then cover it with the funnel. And then just as you practiced, grab that hollow ice ball and insert the funnel. If you lift up the funnel a little bit, that'll increase some of the airflow and help fill up the ball with smoke. Once it's full of smoke, very quickly plug it up with the toothpick and set it aside. Then very carefully place it inside of a rocks glass. Slowly pour the cocktail over the ice ball and note that the ball will float a little bit. Then pass your guests the hammer and let them smash away. This is a pretty challenging trick, but one that's really cool if you can pull it off. So if you guys thought this was interesting, I'd greatly appreciate you sharing with a friend or subscribing if you haven't already. Until next time, cheers. To get these cocktail recipes, links to the equipment, and early access to videos, check out cocktailchemistrylab.com.